Chapter 7 Finally the day came when the Lord said to Noah, Go into the boat with all your family, for among all the people of the earth I consider you alone to be righteous. Take along seven pairs of each animal that I have approved for eating and for sacrifice, and take one pair of each of the others. Then select seven pairs of every kind of bird. There must be a male and a female in each pair to ensure that every kind of living creature will survive the flood. One week from today I will begin forty days and forty nights of rain, and I will wipe from the earth all the living things I have created. So Noah did exactly as the Lord had commanded him. He was six hundred years old when the flood came, and he went aboard the boat to escape, he and his wife and his sons and their wives. With them were all the various kinds of animals, those approved for eating and sacrifice and those that were not, along with all the birds and other small animals. They came into the boat in pairs, male and female, just as God had commanded Noah. One week later, the flood came and covered the earth. When Noah was six hundred years old, on the seventeenth day of the second month, the underground waters burst forth on the earth, and the rain fell in mighty torrents from the sky. The rain continued to fall for forty days and forty nights. But Noah had gone into the boat that very day with his wife and his sons, Shem, Ham, and Japheth, and their wives. With them in the boat were pairs of every kind of breathing animal, domestic and wild, large and small, along with birds and flying insects of every kind. Two by two they came into the boat, male and female, just as God had commanded. Then the Lord shut them in. For forty days the floods prevailed, covering the ground and lifting the boat high above the earth. As the waters rose higher and higher above the ground, the boat floated safely on the surface. Finally, the water covered even the highest mountains on the earth, standing more than twenty-two feet above the highest peaks. All the living things on earth died, birds, domestic animals, wild animals, all kinds of small animals, and all the people. Everything died that breathed and lived on dry land. Every living thing on the earth was wiped out. People, animals, both large and small, and birds. They were all destroyed, and only Noah was left alive, along with those who were with him in the boat. And the water covered the earth for 150 days.